hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you how to delete a rows dynamically using jQuery I am adding new row see here we got a new row with a selected checkbox so let's add a new row new row let's enter some details Charan Charan at gmail.com sad is something like that I'm giving some random text. Now I want to delete the first row and the last row, one and three, delete rows. See it's gone. I want to delete this row also, delete row. That's it. We are deleting the rows from the table dynamically using jQuery. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. In my previous video, I have shown how to add a new multiple rows into HTML table dynamically using jQuery. Add new row. See here the controls are adding. Enter name, some children at gmail.com and salary. If you don't know how to add a new rows dynamically into your HTML table using jQuery, at the end of this video tutorial, you will get the link. Now in this video I will show you I want to delete the rows dynamically using jQuery. For that I am adding one checkbox column row into this HTML table and one button control to delete the selected checkbox row in this HTML table. Let's start the coding part. And this is the code we have just seen the output on the browser. So let's add a checkbox control header in the table element after tr I am adding th let's close the th which is select after that the columns I am adding dynamically in this t body using jQuery script and here is the controls which are dynamically adding into this t body Let's add a checkbox control. Copy this one, paste here. Input type checkbox name is equals to checkbox. I don't require this placeholder for this checkbox control. After adding the checkbox control in the table dynamically, come to the bottom in the table footer t foot I'm adding another button control break let's copy this button control I'm pressing here the button value is delete row or rows And the ID I am changing to Del Ross. That's it. We have done the designing part. Let's check the output how it looks. Let's save the file. I'm reloading the browser. Add new. See here we got a checkbox control and button control. Let's add some values. Chen Chen at gmail.com is salary is fifteen thousand. Add new. So it's working now. Now we need the script. The selected checkbox controls the rows must be deleted when I click this delete row button control. Let's add the jQuery script. In the same script, dollar between double quotes. I'm adding hash the button control ID which is a del rows I'm adding here dot click function so here the function starts I want to delete the selected checkbox control 
in the table T body. So let's copy this one. T body dot find in this table I am finding the checkbox control between single quotes input name is equals to now double quotes I am adding the checkbox name dot each method let's add the function if condition dollar this dot is between double quotes colon check if it's checked I want to remove that row from the HTML table dollar this dot parents between double quotes so the row I want to delete I'm adding tr dot remove method that's it we have done the complete coding part let's save this file we we'll check the final output on the browser I'm adding new row so here we got a new row with a selected checkbox so let's add a new row New row. Let's enter some details. Charan, Charan at gmail.com. Sad is something like that. I'm giving some random text. Now I want to delete the first row and the last row. One and three. Delete rows. See, it's gone. I want to delete this row also. Delete row. That's it. We are deleting the rows from the table dynamically using jQuery.